The whole business of remembrance is in the air at this time of the year. Traditionally, traditionally it is linked this weekend to the end of the horrors of the Great War, when a time of great tribulation gave way to sombre peacefulness, opening a path for reconciliation. The Church devotes the whole month of November to remembering those who have gone before us, marked with the sign of faith. In doing so, we remember the kindness of those who have died and their influence on our lives. This whole experience of remembrance is crucial in our lives. When we remember someone, we are drawn closer to them. Our memories of them bring us comfort, especially if that person has now gone to the Lord. The wise virgins in our Gospel reading today are masters at remembrance, remaining recollected throughout their vigil. They have prudently tended their lamps and conserved their oil, and so they are ready to receive the bridegroom. Their friends, on the other hand, the other virgins, they failed at the last hour. The message from our Gospel passage today is readiness. We need to be ready. We need to be vigilant. We need to be watchful. We need to be prepared. That's the way to be in the bridegroom's company. And that is where we all desire to be. Jesus comes to offer us love and mercy. He comes to offer us peace and reconciliation. Let us never forget this. And let us always remember God's love for each and every one of us. Lest we never forget, Jesus comes to save us from death and to offer us eternal life.